to copy and paste cinematic login into your image after doing your screen retouching all you have to do is create a stamp visible layer by pressing on ctrl shift alternate e so once you create a stamp visible layer i'm going to be copying this color grading right here this cinematic color grading and paste it on this image right here so if you want to get cinematic color grading colors all you have to do is come to google and just search cinematic movie color grading and select any one you want so you can see that there's a lot of options right here so i'm going to be trying this one for this image so after you download it save it on your download or anywhere on your pc so after creating a stamp visible layer you come to your filter and just convert it for smart filter so after you convert it to a smart filter now i want to copy and paste the color grading so come to your filter again come to your neural filters right here click on it and it's just going to open so next thing you're going to do come to your color transfer right here click on color transfer and make sure you turn it on like this so what i'm going to do next we are going to bring that image we downloaded that cinematic image we downloaded from google into photoshop so that it can automatically copy the color of that image so to do that click on custom right here and click on this folder icon and just look for where you download the image so mine is on my download and just change this png to jpeg and this is the joker right here so this is the image so just click on it use this image and just going to process the colors of that image and add it to your image and make sure your preserved luminosity is selected to get the existing lightness or exposure of the original image what you can do you can actually add strength to the image color strength and also add a little bit of saturation to the image just to make it pop a little so this is the before and this is the after the before and the after you can see it has copied the colors of this image right here to this image and if you don't like this one all you have to do is click on this folder icon again click on it and just come to the image the way you download the color grading and let me try this first all right here let's see i click on use image i like this one this one really works well for this image so i'm just going to increase the saturation a little bit and also the color strength a little bit so after it has finished processing we automatically have a cinematic color grade this variation before after you're going to see the before and after this is the before and this is the after this color grade is really looking good for this image so i'm going to click on okay uh before and after if it is too much you can actually reduce the opacity and if you want to change it you can actually click on this neural filter that's why we convert it to a smart filter just double click on this neural filter and it's going to come back here and you can actually make any adjustments you want to make because it was smart filter all right so this is how you can easily copy any cinematic color grain from any image at all and paste it to your image if this video was helpful to make sure to give it a like so more people can see this video and if you as well i'll see you guys in my next video stay creative